Tyler. I've been staring at a blank page for probably close to an hour because I didn't know where to begin. I feel so incredibly grateful to have you. You make me feel so loud and safe. Our love and our connection is real. I have so much to look forward to because of you and with you. And I feel so lucky I get to call you mine. Oh my God. Gorgeous. We're gathered here today to witness the joining together of an absolutely incredible couple, Jordan Gibson and Tyler Deans in marriage. And what happens here today can widely be described as a ceremony, but I see it as far much more than that. A ceremony is defined as a ritual observance or a procedure, but that's, that's not why we're here. We're here for celebration. I met Tyler about 15 years ago playing Pop Warner football. Uh, the two of us became incredibly fast friends and we went on to spend almost every weekend together for the next all time five years through high school. Anyway, uh, after graduation, um, I joined the military and our interactions were always either just through text message or emails or brief home visits. But um, one of the emails that I remember most was um, I was three months into a deployment and I got an email from Tyler saying that he had been dating a girl for about six months. He had never told me about a girl before, so I knew this one was pretty serious. You know, you're, you're an incredible guy, Tyler. You're, you're genuine, you're thoughtful, you're confident, you're hardworking, you love my sister. You love the Gators, amen? Thank <laughs> God. <laughs> and you know, from the start, I knew that you were a brother to me, but now I'm so excited that we're here tonight and we're making it official. First of all, I just want to say congratulations, Jordan and Tyler. Jordan, you look stunning. I could barely hold it together up there when you were walking down. Oh! I just have so loved watching you grow into the woman that you've become today. You're not just beautiful, but you're incredibly intelligent. You're hardworking, determined. Um, you, honestly, you're passionate about the things and people that you care about, and you really show that in everything that you do. So Jordan, Tyler wants you to know that, that words can't describe how much he loves you. Obviously, your physical attributes, your beauty, your smile, your eyes. He also loves how organized and efficient you are because Lord knows he's not. He loves your limitless energy, your sense of humor, and he just wants you to know that he just loves you, the beautiful soul that you are inside. And Tyler, Jordan loves how talented you are and the way you figure out every project, even when she gives you the most complicated instructions. She loves, she loves that you think she's as hilarious as she thinks she is. <laughs> and she's so grateful for how you always make sure she feels beautiful and special at all times. She promises to make sure that you always feel loved and cared for, respected and appreciated, and promises to be the best wife and life partner she can be. So I've seen a lot of guys come and go when you have four daughters. You know, see, you know they come and go. And... So here comes Tyler. So who is Tyler? So here's a man who, uh, when I met, was just finishing up uh, schooling to go into the fire department. When you think about when you dedicate your life to be in the fire department, who are you there for to help people in their most adverse times? That's dedicating your life and being trained to do that. How could you not be impressed with that? It's pretty terrific. So Jordan, you know, she's obviously attracted to a very handsome man. But if you know my side of the family, the girls are pretty demanding. So the one thing that Tyler has that nobody else has in this room, the one special thing that I've discovered about this, that Jordan has made the difference to make this night the night, is that Tyler is a first responder.
Fast forward to a couple months later, I came home and I was introduced to Jordan for the first time. And uh, on first impression, she was smart, funny, she liked the right football team, and she has a smile that lights up a room. Um, but the thing that impressed me the most about you, Jordan, was how much you lit up my best friend. My wish for you all is um, continue to build a life together, go on adventures, and create a unique story because this is what life is all about. In closing, um, I want to thank the bride's family for allowing me this time on such a great day. To Tyler's family, the Deans, the Rakes, the Pools, everybody, um, I, can't I can't express how grateful I am to you all for the love that you've shown me and the lessons that you've taught me. To Jordan, I love you very much. You are a great addition to this family and to my friend's life. Tyler, <laughs> um, I don't want to just thank you for allowing me to be your best man, but to, for allowing me the privilege of being your best friend for the last 15 years. I love you guys. In the presence of God and our friends and family, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Tyler, you can kiss your bride. So I now present to you for the first time ever, Mr. and Mrs. Deans.